It could be the end for a groundbreaking TV program. Lifetime has canceled America's Most Wanted. It's been on the air for 25 years. In a moment, we'll talk to host John Walsh. But first, Elaine Quijano looks back at the show that changed crime fighting. Welcome to the premiere of America's Most Wanted. America's Most Wanted has been helping track down criminals for a quarter of a century now. It's the best thing for law enforcement that's happened in a long time. Host John Walsh created the first of its kind crime fighting show back in 1988, following the abduction and murder of his own son. My little boy was murdered. I know the agony of that. America's Most Wanted is said to have helped catch more than 1,000 fugitives over the past quarter of a century, including 17 people from the FBI's Most Wanted list. The show is also credited with helping to bring home dozens of missing children, including Utah teenager Elizabeth Smart. She'd been captive for more than seven months when someone recognized her kidnapper from the show and called police. America's Most Wanted helped save Elizabeth. And the manhunt starts right now. America's Most Wanted was a mainstay on Fox for more than two decades before moving to Lifetime. While it did not get renewed, the network says it's developing a pilot for a new show featuring Walsh. And there's always a chance another network will step in to keep America's Most Wanted on the air. For CBS This Morning, Elaine Quijano, New York.